today we're going to be obtaining every single version of Whitebeard's fruit, Quake fruit, going all the way from V1 to V3. And this is an insanely strong fruit, stronger than gear 5 in the game actually. But if you guys are interested in winning some Robux, I'm giving away Robux gift cards in my Discord. All you have to do is be subscribed, like this video, comment down below, and join the Discord for the giveaways. But besides that, let's hop in the video. All right, so the first thing we got to do is actually eat the Quake fruit, which we're about to do right now. Go ahead and eat this if we can. Actually, oh wait, we got to delete. Um, We got to get rid of our fruit. So we're going to swap rubber and then we're going to delete dark. Then we're going to swap rubber back over here. There we go. All right, Quake fruit right here. Now we're going to eat the Quake fruit. Boom ate it now we've got quake so to get quake v2 we got quake fruit base pretty much base form you know nothing special so we're gonna you know quake punch we got quake tsunami okay 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 but you know this is nothing special what we want to get is quake v2 and quake v3 and to get the next quake which is v2 we have to go ahead and do the maze so we're gonna go ahead and go to the maze, but for that, we're gonna switch. We're gonna switch our fruit back to rubber because we do have gear five and that's gonna help us a lot in the dungeon. So until we get V2, we're gonna use gear five Luffy. All right, there we go, rubber fruit. Now we've got rubber fruit. We're gonna go ahead and head towards the teleporters. So I'll meet you guys at the teleporters. All right, so let's go ahead and get out of here, man. We got the maze so we're gonna hop in the maze so basically how this works is pretty much every time we beat it we get a certain percentage to get um the v2 book pretty much to evolve into v2 so we're gonna have to beat this a, a lot of times but i'm not gonna put you guys through that if it takes too many tries i'll just go straight to me getting it you know what i mean but let's hop in this and let's go crazy all right so now we're in the maze so i'm gonna go ahead and pop gear fit hey y'all can get a free gear fit showcase right quick though too so it's a win-win situation we're gonna go ahead and hop in here and let's see what we can do Giant stomp. Let's hit them with the hand clap. But this is like, oh, okay. So it's like, uh, it's like we proceed every time we beat the first wave. I don't really got speed like that. But you know, hit them with the Kaminari. Boom. Oh, this is easy. This is light. This is not too hard. Not too hard. But the only thing is, it's a, it's a, it's a small, a really small percentage. So might have to do this a couple times. But I'll meet you guys when we get to the end and see if we get it. Okay. Oh, Whitebeard. Okay, y'all see Whitebeard? Instantly defeated him, bro. Too easy. And we have to look in our inventory to see if we get the book. It's not going to like tell us or anything. And we have to click yes to keep going. We got to keep doing this a lot of times. So got to watch out for that scroll that we're going to get. It's going to be like a scroll or a book. Whenever we get it, I'll meet you guys. See if we can defeat him. Let's go back. I didn't know he was strong like that. I didn't know I had to watch out. Ay, yeah, yeah. Dude's a damage machine. That's what I'm telling y'all. Blackbeard is no joke. Go ahead and hit him with that. All right, he's dead. See if we got anything. Oh, I got it. I got quick scroll. No way. No way, I got it already, I got it already, I got it already. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Alright, so let's go ahead and... But let's go ahead, let's go back and let's use this, and I'm gonna use it in this, uh, this dungeon. Alright, so we're back in. We all got it, so we're gonna... We all, we both got it, so we're gonna go ahead and switch to... I'm gonna switch to... What is it called? Quake. Alright, swap Quake. Alright, for sure. Alright, now we're gonna go ahead, use this Quake scroll. See what we got. Ugh, ugh, severe tsunami. God, mm, bro, liberation, liberation. Hold on. Oh, we got, we got a uh, dark matter and what you call it? Not dark matter. We get the dark fruit and quake. What? Mm, uh, Island shake. Okay, so we got quake and dark. Now we gotta get V three. All right, so now we gotta go to the second C because that's where Whitebeard's located. And supposedly Whitebeard V three does more damage than Gear five. We gonna go ahead and see that. But let's go ahead and teleport to well, not multiverse. Whoa, watch out! Teleport to second C. All right, there we go. All right, meet y'all on second C. All right, so it turns out to get quake V three, I have to go to C three, and to get to third C, I need to complete all these requirements right here. Twenty five thousand total stats. Kill a sea beast five more times. Beat the leopard dungeon five more times and collect one more poneglyph so i guess we got to waste no time and go straight to that probably gonna start with killing or not killing but beating the leopard dungeon five more times all right so here's the leopard dungeon we have to go all the way back to the first c sorry about that buzz We're gonna, we have to go all the way back to the first c this is a strong dungeon this is not gonna be easy yeah oh no strong this is, no, it's actually going to be hard though, for real. But I think two gear five should be more than enough to defeat this. So uh, let's defeat this five times and wrap this up. All right, so we're going to go ahead and pop this gear fit. All right, where is he? Oh, yo, he's cooking me. He just instantly one tapped me, bro. How am I supposed to fight this? 
Oh, from a distance. Okay. He just instantly tapped me. Holy, bro. All right, yeah. So we got to hit him with Kaminari from a distance. That dude's... Yeah, it does decent damage. That's like a million. A milli. Oh, my gosh. All right. I'll meet you guys when we're on the last one, I guess. We're about to wrap this up because this is going to take a while. All right. So we're on the last one, finishing this up. You know, we kind of... We kind of... We kind of... uh. Got used to it. A little cheese method hiding behind the wall. We just sit back and just use some some long distance moves. So if y'all need some tips on getting this, bro, good luck, y'all. That's all I gotta say. Good luck. This is not easy, bro. Especially if you don't got gear up. Especially if you gotta use the quake fruit. Yeah, that's that's tough. That's gonna be hard. But yeah, all right. So I think this is the last one. We finish this. So I'll meet you guys in game for the next task, which is probably gonna be killing five more CBs. All right. So now basically what we have to do is all right. So all I have to do is spawn a boat literally anywhere. I can spawn it right here, right? So just spawn a boat, big old sail ship, all right? Spawn. Now I just sit here literally for 20 to 30 minutes. In those 20, 30 minutes, uh, uh, CB should spawn. So it takes almost half an hour for just one CB. So it's probably gonna take like a couple of hours just to kill them all. But hopefully we get lucky. I'll meet you guys whenever we get the first CBs. Until then, I'm gonna just relax and wait for the CBs to spawn. But what I am gonna do now though is finally, since we're like halfway through, we're gonna go ahead and switch to Quake. So we're gonna go ahead and switch to Quake. I don't want I don't want to be using gear five the whole you know the whole video so we do have Yami and Wake pretty much which is super cool that they did that in this game now let's go back to the boat and just sit there and wait for the next uh CBs to come over all right so we got a CBs now I'm definitely getting credit for this one because this one's all mine all mine so we're gonna go ahead and defeat it real quick hopefully we don't die I don't know this this does damage oh my gosh so we're gonna go ahead and do all this dark matter Island Shape, Devastating Punch, Tsunami, all that. Go ahead and get my damage in. Tsunami, we're big chilling right now. Got the damage. Island Shake, hopefully I don't die. Please give me like a level up or a power up or something, bro. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Don't die. Right, Tsunami, come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't do me, don't do me like this. All right, so we're pulling up right now. Oh, that has range. We're gonna try to use Tsunami right here. Hopefully that hits him. Jump, Gepo! All right, Devastating Punch. Dark Matter. The Dead. All right, now I'm gonna go check my credit. All right, let's see. Did we get credit? Did we get credit? Did we get credit? Okay, yeah, we got credit. All right, nice. Now we need four more. This, this, it should be easy now. All right. All right, so we got the CBs right here. For the die, let's go ahead and kill it. Ah, no, bro, I'm stuck in one. God, man, I, I need to get on this boat, bro. I need to chill, bro. This game is stressing me, bro. Not even going joke. This is a very stressful game to farm, but it's worth it, honestly. All right, come on, get this over with. This is going to be three after this. Almost done. There we go. Oh, wait, what did I get? I got something. What did I get? Hold on. What did I just... Human essence? What is human essence? I don't know. If anybody knows what that is, let me know what that is. Let's see how many we got left. Should tell it. Oh, wrong dude. We got to go to this dude right here. But yeah, anybody knows what that is, let me know what it is. We got three more and we're going to be done. We can go focus on the, the easy things. All right, I got this last CB's left. It's about to die. This CB's kind of ugly, though. I'm not going to lie. We're going to kill it. Hold on. See if we can kill it before it kills us. All right, there we go. Now we've got two left, I'm pretty sure. But this is a, it's a walk in the park, man. It's easy, bro. I'll see y'all when I got the next CB's. All right, here we go. We got another one. Another one. God did. All right, let's go, bro. Tell him bring out the whole ocean. Tell him bring out the lobster. Tell him to bring out the whole ocean. All right, let me, bro. What am I talking about, bro? This is what happens when you play this game for too long and you just slowly just losing your sanity. I gotta subscribe for me, bro. Just hit that subscribe button for me, bro. I'm losing my sanity trying to give you this content, man. I love to make videos like this, but dang. All right, let's go ahead and kill this. Probably gonna die, so I'm just gonna run back. All good. All right, we're back. Ran back. Go ahead and hit him with that. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Shake, oh, tsunami. Good. I'm gonna take a little bit of damage. Dark Soul, Island Shake, Devastating Punch. All right. So now we've got one more left. Just one more, and then we're gonna be done. And then we can go fight Whitebeard and get V3. All right. Now we got this CB right here. We could literally just one tap it, and then we're gonna be done. Go ahead, hit him with that. Okay. No, is he dead? Okay, yeah, he is dead. So now we're gonna reset. We're gonna see how many we got left. We should have. We should be done with that. And the only thing we should like need to get is my level up and one more Poneglyph, which both are going to be super easy. Yeah, get 25k total stats and one more Poneglyph. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and do that literally instantly and I'll meet you guys when I have that done and then we're gonna go proceed to the third scene. Okay, after about two days later, I have finally got 25k overall stats. Finally, we're gonna go into the third C. We're gonna talk to the boss. Would you like to teleport to third C? I'm ready. Meet you on the third C. Let's click that bet. Let's go. Okay, here we are. We're in third C. So now we're gonna go to Blacksmith's house. This is actually right behind the Blacksmith house. I'll meet you guys whenever we get to Whitebeard. All right, so now what I've gotta do is now we're at Third C, Whitebeard Island. So pretty much every age server, 20 minutes, Whitebeard spawns right here. There's a one in four chance actually of him spawning because there's four world bosses in this C. So let's see if that one in four chance is now. And then on top of that, we gotta get the 8% drop for his scroll to go into V3. So let's see if he spawns. All right, we got like three seconds on here. Bro, he did not spawn, bro. He didn't spawn. He didn't spawn. Bro, this face is so ugly, bro. I had to buy it though. It was only 25 Robux. I'll meet you guys whenever Whitebeard spawns. Okay. Turns out, I think world bosses might be glitched or something. Did everything trying to like get this boss to spawn in. I don't even like world bosses actually doesn't spawn in it at all. I know it's like a 50% chance, but like it's not spawning in. Nothing is spawning in. Been doing this for maybe two, four, five, four hours, four, five hours. And I've gotten not a single world boss. I waited 20 minutes. I waited an hour in one server. I think it might be glitched as of right now. And I've already been grinding for like a couple hours. So I'm gonna just wrap it up right here. I'm never doing anything like this ever again. Ugh. But let me know what y'all want next. Stay safe, stay healthy. I'll see y'all in the next one, man.